Hi, welcome in. October 31, Setting Goals by Faith. Scripture reading, Proverbs 31. She watches over the affairs of her household and does not eat the bread of idleness. Proverbs 31, verse 27. The godly woman of Proverbs 31 certainly ran an effective household, but much of that is because she was proactive about the goals she wanted to accomplish. Of course, the world is full of advice on how to set and achieve objectives. The process usually starts with us identifying who we want to become and what we should do to be successful. But Christian goal setting, as we see with this woman, is to start with a God-centered focus. The attitude is, I want to be who the Lord wants me to be, who he created me to become. So I will look to the Father for direction in all areas of my life and obey. Seems easy enough. So why do we often fall short? Sometimes we lack knowledge of how to identify the Lord's plan. The solution is to give attention to the word of God. We meditate on Jesus's life and words learning his pattern for living and identifying specific steps to take. Lack of faith can be another hindrance. Why should we set goals when we are convinced we cannot do what God is asking? The answer is to build our faith through studying the Bible and applying it to our lives. Finally, fear of failure can prevent us from establishing goals. We can overcome this obstacle by remembering that in Christ, there is no condemnation and he will enable us to accomplish all he calls us to do. Do you desire to move ahead in your Christian life, growing more like Jesus and acting less like your old self? Goal setting with the right attitude and focus will help. So ask the Father to lead you, become all, to become all you were created to be. Father, only you know what you want to accomplish through my life. I want to be who you want me to be. Lead me, Lord. I will obey. Amen.